Hi, Pirian. Yellow is a Nagupuri Indri, which means power. My name is Indri in the Kuku Yellow language. I'm 11 years old and I live in far north Queensland. I'm part of the Kuku Yalanji people. Yindali is the language word for the forest kingfisher. That's a type of bird with bright blue and white feathers. Similar to a kookaburra, but smaller. It is my animal totem. The forest kingfisher is one of many animals that you can find in the Daintree rainforest. It's in far north Queensland and it's really big, about the size of Sydney. The Kuku Yalanji people have lived in this area for thousands of years. Their songs and legends continue to give this place a special meaning. The forest is very important to us because water can always be found. When there was no food, mai, in the bush, my family would move through the forest to find it. We know which special plants to use for our foods and medicine, how to hunt animals to eat, and where the sacred spots are. My family had taught me never take a rock from the rainforest or waterways. Always introduce yourself to the land when you arrive. We always throw a rock into the river to tell the rainbow serpent that we are from this land or we are just passing through. The Daintree Rainforest is actually the oldest rainforest in the world. It is 180 million years old. It's called the rainforest because it gets a lot of rain every year and it's home to heaps and heaps of different plants and animals. Like the biggest tree frog in the world, 60% of all Australia's butterflies and 131 different types of reptiles. Yep, even crocodiles. There are also lots and lots of different birds, including some really strange looking ones, like cassowaries. Just like a little creek. My favorite thing about living near the Daintree is walking through the rainforest, swinging from vines, swimming in safe freshwater creeks, and going down natural water slides. The forests aren't just important to me. They're important to millions of people around the world. They provide animal and people with food, water and shelter. And they help soak up greenhouse gases. But humans are destroying forests. Did you know every minute about 36 football fields of forests around the world are chopped down for wood or to make room for houses or farming? That's having a big effect on our planet. It's why we need to learn about the forest and protect them. When Australia was colonized, a lot of our native forest was cleared. And while some forests like the Daintree are now protected, it still faces a threat from things like climate change, weeds, and feral animals. Australians need to protect forests by buying food in a sustainable way, use less paper, reduce your carbon footprint so future generations can keep admiring and enjoying our forests. Most of all, respect our beautiful land. If you wish to visit a rainforest, you should make sure you do not leave any rubbish behind, do not feed the animals, and most importantly, leaving nothing but footprints and take nothing but memories. I hope I've all taught you something about the rainforest and maybe one day you can visit the Daintree too.